there is no way in hell we get anything we want because it's gonna be in an absolute disaster what's up chief we're gonna talk about duncan what's wrong with duncan he's upset about his scout we know that yeah i mean this that and the other but if if he has to ask me one more time hey what's my position what do you guys actually want from me it seems like you guys are like really split on everything that you guys want to do you guys communicate what? this that and the other if he has to ask me that one more time i'm gonna absolutely lose my so mind we need to establish like what his job is i haven't even spoken to him <laughs> Advisor, was he also a black man? Like, hold on, hold on, Barrett. Pretty did nice. you just say he keeps asking this, that, whatever? And then you follow that up with, so we have to establish what his job is. So basically, you're saying he's right. <laughs> yeah, but he can't say we're divided when neither of us have spoken to him. But it, well, he has, well, but you haven't. So actually, he's right. <laughs> he can be uh, that kind of like filter between. I mean, I'm going to give him another like. I mean, you gave him the position, not me. Yeah, I know, but I didn't expect him to like it. I don't know why I didn't expect Take him to it seriously. That. It's Duncan. Yeah, that's understandable. Yeah, I'm going to start directing more people his way. I don't know. He's also got like a multitude of other concerns, Bring which surprise, surprise. Really? Like what? I'm going to say this between you guys. I'm going to say this, okay? Uh, he's a, he's like a, he was a backdoor Ruth supporter. Under the table, he was pushing, he was pushing cash. Under the table, he was a... What? No, no, no. There's no way. What do you mean he's pushing cash under the table? What was that? That was like a metaphor. Oh, you're the one that was prosecuting her. So, uh, hello? Maybe that's why you and you and him are on different sides of the board. Wait, hey, hold that? on, hold on. In what way was he a Ruth supporter? He literally told me if he didn't team, think no what anything that Ruth did was bad. <laughs> Does he know everything that Ruth did? Yes! Like everything? Pretty much, yeah. Even the Brian Knight shit? Yeah, oh, well, Ruby, you know, I never told you. No, no, no. I was part of the situation. Wait. When well, Slacks well, and myself and, and not, I think McNulty spoke to Brian right about the situation and Brian out. said, that's not my statement. Where's my statement? I said, what are you talking about? This is all that's in the report. And Slack said, I don't have any other statement. Oh, no yeah. shit. Yeah, and this was like right before all the change happened. Brian is standing in front of us and he's saying, that's not my statement. Yeah. I supplied a statement to Shift One just a day ago. Where is it? Yeah, so Brian And then told... Slack said, I'll find out about it. And that was it. Yeah, and then Ruth never showed back up. But the mm -hmm. thing is, is Ruth and Aldo had that statement. Brian told me, because I didn't even know. Brian talked to Aziz and I didn't know that Brian had talked to Ruth and Aldo about it. I... They literally threw well, the statement I... in the trash. How, how insane I just is don't that? know where it is, yeah. Like what the hell? Because think, think about how crazy this, this entire situation Situation. I had nine daps, right? And then the and then the rest like I I had like four or five daps that were about to fall off like a few days later, like two or three days after I got the, the 10 daps, that one additional dap that was given to me was because of the Brian Knight thing. And then Ruth was the one pushing real hard for that last dap. So her and Aldo knew, and she pulled Aldo in as part of that vote to essentially give herself two votes to try and get me fired. Now this is all said and done, but it makes what happened even more insane. And Slacks was sitting there talking to me about how I was about to make you a senior officer this next week and, and whatever the hell. He was like, you were gonna be our next senior officer this and that and you know now i have to deal with this and i'm like i i literally did not do this i'm telling you this and then i was pissed at brian and aziz was pissed at brian and then while i was suspended aziz and brian spoke and then i didn't see brian until like half a week ago so two days before you got suspended mcnulty and i knew something was not going well so we pulled turner flop bones and slacks aside and we said you've got to change dap system Who because seen this coming you know not having a dap roll on for 60 days you you're killing people the the little one daps they should be rolling off sooner so we proposed the idea hoping they were going to make it retroactive so that Denzel could come back and you wouldn't get suspended but they didn't yeah holy the shit way, the the minor dab infractions they're still like 30 days aren't they yes they are it's, they it's another that I agree it's another su subject we need to talk about then it's done it'll be 15. I mean, yeah. I would just, I would just make them all the same. Listen, if somebody's like wearing the wrong hat or something like that, I want to be able to, or if yeah. somebody calls me like Chief Johnson when I don't want to be clearly called that, I want to be able to slap that one dap on them, but I don't want them to be held responsible for that for like 30 days, well, I for think, like 60 days. I think you should have like a two tier punishment system, a two tier demerit system. So you, they shouldn't even be called daps. So you have like daps that are 30 days and then you have like some bullshit for the little stuff that has a, a different set of consequences.
Yeah, but then people won't ever take the like, smaller thing. What'll make people take it seriously is the punishment. So if it's like, hey, the, the, like the daps are the, the serious shit. And then this other one is like, okay, well, you got to go do this. Hey, you're doing foot patrol at Senior Buns for a shift. Conan disobeyed chain of command. He's not even hired yet. We had him run two flights of stairs. And oh, he threw shit. up all over bones. So, <laughs> I don't know. Not really related. I mean, still. Yeah, and we haven't seen him on duty since. <laughs> Well, yeah, he's got an interview and a psyche about tomorrow. Oh, shit, okay. Speaking of which, I I've kind of briefly spoken to you about this, but I would love for you to teach it uh, at the academy. Okay. So, like, what do, what do you want me to teach? What do you want to teach? I mean, honestly, I could teach the whole thing. What do you think you're best with? Uh, I could teach... I could teach processing. I could teach... Uh, I could teach traffic. I could teach pursuit. Yeah, maybe we just stick to, uh, like, processing and... Well, I'd teach pursuit on the other end. How about how not to eject from your car? Um, uh, no, I can't teach that one. Ah, <laughs> uh, true. Okay. Negotiation, I could teach. Let me think, what else? Firearms. Firearms. How not to shoot someone in the head. Scene control. Oh, no, I can't teach that either. <laughs> Okay. Another situation that we're going to have is uh, apparently the mayor is going to be trying to dab uh, Matt Rhodes. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> This is, uh, I'm not going to lie to you. I have nothing to do but laugh at this. I want you guys to um, open up Twitter and search up Rhodes' name and look at what he retweeted. And that is the basis upon which the mayor wants to dap him. Hide in your big tower and a rouge weather. Does, does Lang Buddha know how to spell? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Oh, a rouge weather, it should be called. Months or minutes, you useless brick. I mean, minutes minutes does make more sense because there's, like, new folks to the city who, like, you know. I, I No, Cornwood, if you're new to the city, something is very wrong. No, If I'm, this is the first <laughs> city that you've ever lived in, I'm sorry, something is... I know y'all would, <laughs> would never believe this, but it was mine. <laughs> No. <laughs> yep, yeah, I know. Well, well you know, it's just the experience so that I had coming in. It was just one of them things where... You're telling me this is because of you. Uh-huh. Or no, wait, Who what? Is? No, that's not because of me. I mean, look. Yeah, he wants to give him like three dabs or something, apparently. He hasn't spoken to me about it, but Rhodes did. <laughs> 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 Oh, which, uh, which brings me to this. Uh, one way or another, whether it's before, it'll probably just be Project with this next term, but I think we need to kind of reevaluate the uh, PD liaison role. There's certain ways that you can go about it, and I don't think how Nagoto has gone about it is necessarily wrong, but I think, especially if Max is going to be in office again, we need somebody else. And I can think of no better person than Rose. <laughs> Would he be? No, he wouldn't be no, awake. No, he, no, he, I, I no way in already. hell. To him about this already, and he said that he would do it. We look, yeah. Matt Rose. Look, I love Matt Rose. Don't get me wrong. Matt Rose is the only person in this department who's who is a higher rank than me. You know, whenever I was around years ago. Okay, uh -huh. he was under sheriff whenever I was senior captain. But uh, look. You're going to put two of the pettiest sons of bitches in the whole damn city in the same room together, handling the most important decisions that matter? It's going to be one a thing, disaster. One thing I know it about Rose, so it doesn't dude. matter who he's put in front of. He's going to speak his mind. He's going to speak the truth. Oh, God, the mayor's calling me. Hey, Mr. Mayor. <laughs> dude, no? it would be so funny, dude. I don't think so. Uh, okay, so Pat Downing. Yeah. Where? Wait, where's Pat Downing been? He, he'd have to become a full officer first. He's, he's still a cadet. You know, I, I have TO'd Pat Downing years ago. Okay. He was far and away the worst cadet I ever had. <laughs> oh, oh, that, that's not good. <laughs> yeah, but what he's about a, Jimbo? He, he's a great guy, though. Oh, I, yeah, I wasn't around when Jimbo got here, but Jimbo probably would have been worse than Pat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, I think, uh, I mean, thank God I never, I never FTO Joey Parmesan, because that would have been real bad. Joey, why does that name sound familiar? He was the one that started crying during Academy and then never showed up again after uh, uh, after he got uh, fired as a, as a joke. That was a long time ago. No, I, I think Joey Parmesan was the greatest disaster known to mankind. I'm trying to think here. In a world where Matt Rhodes is our PD liaison, two things are going to happen that's guaranteed. One, no, three things are guaranteed. One, Rhodes is going to speak his mind. 
probably as much as anybody else, if not more than anybody else, it is going to be, it's probably going to be fireworks in that meeting every week, two, and three, there is no way in hell we get anything we want because it's going to be an absolute disaster between Rose and, and Mary Thoroughbred. It's going to be bad. So, I think it sounds great, <laughs> but we have to be ready to live with the consequences. I'm gonna be on it. I fucking hate the city council. Wait, what's wrong? Because when they, when they made this f***ing amendment to the... Okay, uh, I, I've been thinking about this for a few days. And an right. When they made this amendment to um, the circuit. police continuity plan, reading it from commissioner to chief of police, one the one line Lab that which fire. we would have control over the PD and not the f***ing mayor, he, he just left it at Callaway. commissioner and nobody said a word uh, about it. He changed it. Wait, how did he change they, it? He cha they changed it like two days before it happened. Um, to be fair, I don't really blame him because how? How we can start getting upset at people for what they for their thoughts and opinions? They don't match up with yours. <laughs> yeah. And how, and how the f is it like? I mean, okay, you, you got to think about it this way though. Think about how just it was a it was bad before. I'd argue it's still the same. No. You think, do you think PD right now is still the same? No, I don't think PD is the same. But the predicament that we're in with just this massive, you know, I'm going to keep my mouth shut. I don't know. Look, I, I, I just think, uh, I just think that's like legal mumbo jumbo. I don't, I, I really don't think that he is acting in such a way to pull some bullshit on us. Wait, wait, hold on. Barrick, I need you to say just hello. Hello? Oh my gosh, I fixed it! Holy shit. If, no. I, if I read the legislation right, at any point there could be a commissioner. Yeah, I mean, I That's think there, there someday probably will be a commissioner. I mean, I just think it's like a fail-safe sort of thing. Because he doesn't know how good you or Barrick or anybody else is going to be right off the rip. You know, you know what I mean? Because he don't, know, he don't know any of us that well. The issue is, like, I don't even care if it's me. But the issue is not somebody on the outside having full control. And that was the only reason I was in agreement with it. Because I knew that whoever was chosen, no matter who that would be, would have that control. And nobody else from the outside would just be able to just walk in and based on their own, Pretty like, unfiltered mean. opinion. So what you're saying is you're worried you about... Yeah, because he can fire whoever the fuck he wants. It, well, are, are you talking about when a new mayor comes in? No. You know what? I'm going to dap him. And then I'm just telling him what he wants. I'm going to dap him and then i'll just take him when he's out of office wait what wait huh wait you're gonna dap i'll just dap Rhodes to do what he wants and just play this fucking stupid little game and then we'll just change when, the dap system before you dap him yeah and give him three baby daps oh yeah i'm gonna dap him and then uh when it's over i'll just get rid of him wait you'll get rid wait you'll get rid of Rhodes? no the dap oh. <laughs> he said him not them get rid of m oh get rid of him m who not him sorry i mean if we don't if we don't keep morale high, uh, people are just not yeah. going to come on duty. Yeah, no, I mean, I agree with that. Are, are y'all really that worried about the, the, the mayor, like, yeah. causing long-term problems? No one person should have absolute power. No, I mean, I agree with that. But, like, I, I think it's it's less absolute power and more so... <laughs> hey, I'm gonna I'm gonna step in if there's some bullshit that happens. But it's not bullshit. It's literally a fucking tweet. No, I'm, ta I'm, no, I'm talking about the legislation. I'm not talking about the... The tweet. I think yeah, that I think about? I think the tweet shit is dumb. Looking what are you talking about with the legislation? Then? Wait, say that one more time. Now to the black ball There's the power to enact the commissioner. Yeah, also got, based on how that make... legislation yeah, is, once he's out of office, right, well, Tony, I'm break it's up no longer get some gas. like that whole thing is val is invalid. Yeah.